Uh, Bitcoin failed to sustain a rebound at the May 9th Wall Street open, while new macro data bolstered risk asset bulls. Uh, data from Crypto Moon Markets Pro and TradingView showed a brief BTC spike to $61,750, which failed to hold. Uh, this came on the back of the latest United States jobless claims that beat expectations to reach their highest levels in nine months, uh, 231,000 versus 212,000 uh, expected. Uh, the Federal Reserve had recently flagged signs of strain within the labor market as being a key reason to consider interest rate cuts. And despite this, BTC USD appeared in no mood for celebration at the time of writing, dropping back below $61,000. Uh, some big bids appear between fifty-nine to sixty thousand dollars. Popular trader Don Crypto Trades noted in his latest order book analysis on X, formerly Twitter, and uh, earlier Crypto Moon reported on liquidity being taken both above and below stop price, while BTC USD stayed within a rigid trading range. And it's the latest update to Telegram channel subscribers on the day. Meanwhile, trading firm QCP Capital suggested that this behavior would continue. Markets are currently pricing in two Fed cuts this year, with the first cut only expected in September. To make things worse, BTC spot ETF flows have flattened it out again after strong inflows from last Friday and the recent Monday. It wrote, Adopting a more optimistic view, popular trader Titan of crypto gave a potential upside target of $75,000 for the end of the current consolidation period. An accompanying chart showed a possible inverse head and shoulders pattern forming with downside limited to much beyond $55,000 should weakness re-enter the market. The worst case scenario would be BTC uh, to drop to the bottom line of the descending broadening wedge. He explained, more broadly, Titan of Crypto expects Bitcoin to hit six figures for the first time, acknowledging that time and patience was required on the part of market participants. Watch the 61.5K level. The manipulation could occur there, part of an ex-post stated on May 8th.